Hi, Lisa Stedman here for lisastedman.com. Welcome to day 10 of my 30 day get out there challenge. So we're 10 days into my 30 day challenge. Are you hitting your stride? Are you getting comfortable talking to cuties? Are you practicing those flirting skills that my fellow relationship experts are offering up to you on my blog? And if so, report your progress back on the blog. We want to know how you're doing. We're excited for your success during the 30 day challenge. And today is no exception. Today I'm going to talk about something a little different. It's not about how to get out there and meet a cutie. It's how to feel good about getting out there and meeting a cutie. I'm talking about your wardrobe. Now, if you're just, if you're, oh, why'd she say wardrobe? Ah, if you're feeling really bad about that, that's telling us something. So I want you to go to your closet, open your closet, look in your closet and ask yourself how you feel about your closet. And if what comes up is I hate it, I hate everything in here, I hate putting it on, I hate going out into the world wearing these things, then no wonder you're having trouble meeting cuties because you don't feel good moving in the world in your sexy body. So how do you feel good? You can do it on a budget. You don't have to spend an exorbitant amount of money, but you do need to leave your house every day feeling cute, feeling comfortable, feeling sassy, feeling sexy, feeling desirable. These are the ways you want your wardrobe to make you feel. And if your current wardrobe does not make you feel this way, then we are in some trouble. It's easy to remedy though. You don't have to spend a fortune, but do look at some of my favorite wardrobe stylists websites. Kimberly Seltzer, EliteImageMakeovers.com. Google Sybil Henry. I can't remember her website right off the top of my head, but it's S-Y-B-I-L-H-E-N-R-Y. Those are two of my favorite stylists. They can help you with tips, techniques, and guidance for getting a better wardrobe or working with your existing wardrobe so that when you leave the house, you feel cute. When you see a cutie, you're not like, oh, I wish I wasn't wearing this. You can actually go, I look cute. I'm going to smile. I'm going to make eye contact. I'm going to flirt. I'm going to do all the things that I know I'm supposed to be doing during the 30 day challenge to rock my dating life. So again, if you're cringing over your wardrobe, at least incorporate one or two new things. It can do, you can do this over time. You don't have to break the bank, but you do need to feel good about what you put on your body. So good luck with this. Report your progress on the blog and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.